I want to begin this evening by making a very important distinction that is going to help us understand our journey. And that's the distinction between behavior and character. Behavior pertains to our actions. Behavior pertains to the parts of our body. Behavior is what people see from us. Behavior is what is on the outside. Character pertains to the heart and the state of the heart. It's what people cannot see from the outside. It is what is within ourselves. There's a big difference between behavior and character. Sometimes a person performs an act of generosity. That's a behavior. It doesn't mean that he is a generous person. That is character. We're not only asked to perform acts of forgiveness. That is behavior. We're being asked to be a forgiving person. There's a difference in that. We're not only asked to be humble from the outside. We're being asked to be humble from the inside as well. And from a very young age, one of the realizations that we have is that there is a difference between our behavior and our character. And the more important realization that we have is that people can see our behavior, but they can't see our character. But people judge our character on the basis of our behavior. So if I act as a generous person, people will say he is a generous person. If I act with compassion, people will say he is a compassionate person. People look at our behavior and they judge what is our character. The people are judging me on the basis of what they can see. One day a father came to me and said, I don't know what's happened to my son. Until last year when he woke up in the morning, he got ready for school and he was out in a short time. This year something is different. He spends half an hour in front of the mirror making sure that that line on his hair is razor thin. He didn't care about the clothes he used to wear. Now he cares about the clothes that he wears. What has changed in this young man is that suddenly he's realized that people judge who he is by how he looks. And sometimes we find within ourselves that there is a dual personality. There is a person who exists for the people and there's a person who exists for myself. There's a difference between our behavior and our character.